As Americans, I have to tell you, we're truly blessed in many, many ways with material things and the comforts of life. Was up on the mountain today just behind me and witnessed their people living in conditions that most in America would find unacceptable. They were washing their clothes by hand in a laundromat and uh, because that was the only thing they had. They carry water up a hill. It's literally 600 feet up uh, a steep hill that uh, my four-wheel drive truck has a difficult time in getting up. There are very few of the comforts of home, and yet the people there are peaceful and are joyful for the most part and are happy with what they have and truly enjoy Western visitors or visitors from our country, I should say. I keep forgetting that I'm not in, in Asia. Uh, but this is a phenomenal part of the world and people that are truly in need of uh, all that we can give, I guess is one way to say it. And the, the thing that we've been doing mostly today is reaching out and helping people to understand that there is hope and to give them the assistance that we can. And also behind me is a dental clinic and a doctor's office that is really state of the art. It was set up by Northridge Church in Marshfield and is supported on an ongoing basis by Northridge Church. And this is again a wonderful testament to the kindness and the uh, and the goodness of the people in central Wisconsin to reach out and, and help those people who are otherwise helpless. So an, an interesting and exciting day. I allowed a pastor who Figured he'd never fly, a, never see a drone to actually fly it and to uh, do some flyovers of the soccer field and the church that he has. And uh, played with some kids who were totally excited about the drone that I brought along. So a good day and now we're looking forward to an evening of uh, just uh, being around here and having some fellowship with uh, the good folks that came from the central Wisconsin area. Have a good night.